Previously on Inconceivable. You want to be a filmmaker, right? And between your day job and taking care of your family, when exactly are you going to find the time to be an established director? My roommate and I, we're, we're working on a web series right now. We hear that we can be cops, superheroes, CEOs. But I really wanted to see a woman crap herself on TV. You guys are hilarious. We're like low-key obsessed with you. Obsessed? <laughs> well, not like obsessed, obsessed. You know, don't get ahead of yourself. We're going to have a baby. I'm pregnant. So what about us? Could we just be two super awesome people having a baby and take it one day at a time? I know this is going to sound really stupid. I'm kind of pissed that my parents were so loving and supportive. How is me being pregnant better news than me being gay? That's insane. I mean, don't you want to hang out or something? Celebrate this weight off our chest? I just want to be alone tonight. I said I want to be alone. It's me. I'm Tony. Sorry, guys. Come on in. So, how are you doing? I take it they didn't take it well. They took it extremely well. Ah, oh, those. Jerks? I don't know exactly how I wanted them to react, but a little resistance would have been nice. How is this better than me being gay? I feel you. I once had Trina over for Thanksgiving dinner and my parents were thrilled. My dad asked straight up if I was cured. Exactly. Ugh, I'm, I'm all worked up and I can't even smoke a joint or have a beer. I already hate being pregnant. Oh, but we bought you kombucha. Hello? Hey, this is Adam. Who's this? Hey, it's Brittany. Something horrible just happened. Can I come over? Uh, yeah, uh, sure. What's going on? Everything uh, okay with you and Justin, or? I don't really want to talk about Justin. No, yeah, me neither. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, hey, Britt. <gasps> hey, Mac! Uh, why didn't you tell me Mac was here? I don't know, why didn't you uh, tell me about uh, this? Mac, can you go to your room? I'm actually sending a really important message right now. Go to your room, Mac. Well, I don't have Wi-Fi in my room, so I... Get out. Fine. So, what's, uh, what's going on? Well, I've, uh, I've seen the way you look at me. And I know we've had tension between us in the past, so... Why don't we just get right to it? Mm, 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 mm Kate, uh, you, uh... You have a boyfriend. You do, right? Had a boyfriend, yeah. Until he decided to sleep with my best friend. With Michelle? Yes. Justin and Michelle had sex on my bed. In my frickin' bed. Yes, you need to keep it down. Mac is uh, obsessed with Michelle, and he thinks that she's sleeping with this Trent guy, so... Well, she banged him, too. And you know what? She's gonna want to bang you next. Just as long as it ruins people's lives. And I'm very sorry about that. Uh, what can I do? Me? Okay. Yeah. Great. Uh, I, I can't help but feel like I'm taking advantage of you or something, though. I mean, you're kind of in an emotional state. Maybe, maybe we could talk? I mean, yeah, you know, talk. Yeah, talking, talking's good. 
I too have been going through quite the ordeal the past few days. Could we not make this about you? Right, yeah. <laughs> sure, okay. Ground rules. You're gonna go down on me first, and I'm not gonna go down on you because, well, gross. Then I'll consider having sex with you. Okay? Okay. Hey, you know you can't actually get drunk off that, right? Can I at least pretend I'm drinking? How am I supposed to date when I'm all pregnant and fat? Well, lesbians do like to move fast. Maybe they'll be into it. You're not helping. Look, Sarah and Kristen paid a lot of money for their sperm. You're a catch. I think it's badass that you're keeping this kid. I've already started crocheting little booties for a little rabbit. Rabbit? The baby spirit animal. Oh, yeah, 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 spirit animal. Okay. I am officially done pouting. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have to use the washroom for the hundredth time today. Whoop. Here I go. Can you be less sarcastic? Me? You're talking about a baby spirit animal? What's going on? Oh my god. Oh my god. Everything hurts. It's just morning sickness. No. Oh, this is different. I need you guys to take me to the hospital. Well, I, I can't drive. Neither can I. What? How can you not drive? We live in the city. We don't need to drive. Oh, call, call Adam. Okay. Mm, that's so good. Uh, don't stop. Don't stop. Don't you dare think of stopping. Oh, shit. Sorry. Uh, I got it. Okay, fine. You got a condom? Yeah, just in the headboard. Use the red ones, not the baby ones. He's not answering his phone. Should we just call an ambulance? And pay those ridiculous charges? No, thank you. I don't know what to do. What you Is he coming? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Relax. He's on his way. Oh, thank God. Wait, wait. Who's that dorky guy that Adam's always with? I don't know. No, I like look through his photos. Oh, like, yeah, he's gonna be in here, right? Okay, here it is. It's Mackenzie. Okay. Oh, he's totally family. What? No, no, he's not. Trust me, he's family. Uh, okay, just press the call button okay. on his thing so we can call him. Uh, who is this? Uh, it doesn't matter. Can you please get Adam? It's an emergency. Well, he's kind of busy at the moment. Okay, no, we need Adam now. Go! It's an emergency. Rita needs to go to the hospital, please. Uh. It's Rita. Apparently there's something wrong with the baby. She needs a ride to the hospital. Okay, I'm coming. What? You can't be serious. I'm on my way. Are you serious right now? Who is that? I'm really sorry. Who is that? But I gotta go. I'm so, so sorry. You can stay the night. Door locks itself. Yeah? You can't leave me for a night. Mother of my child needs my help. It's a good time. Left out the lights, left out the lights. Thank you, thank you. Are you feeling nauseous at all? Le left or right? Left or right? Left, right? Left, left, left. 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 Okay. You guys run in, I'll find parking, okay?
Hello? Adam, they're taking her to get an ultrasound. Their word, it might be an ectopic pregnancy. What does that mean? Uh, it, it means that the baby could be growing in the fallopian tubes. Uh, in, instead of... Are you kidding me? It's instead of the uterus. Uh, what, which means? It means that the baby would have no chance for surviving. Okay. Coming right now. Where is she? She's in the second room, on the right. Hey. Hey. Are you okay? Yeah, that was better now. Apparently it was just my uterus stretching. And the baby? Well, look for yourself. It's a pretty strong heartbeat for eight weeks. She's gonna be okay. We're all gonna be okay. She? Yeah. It, it's a sh it's a girl? Oh my god. <laughs> We're gonna have a girl? Yeah. It's impossible to tell at this point. It's just a uterus and a heartbeat. Right. Well, but I mean, I've got a pretty strong intuition about these things and I'm pretty sure it's a girl. But as a medical professional, it's impossible to tell if it's a girl or a boy at this point. Okay, but it feels like a girl. Yeah, a boy or girl. Uh, just don't ever scare me like that again, okay? okay. Almost had a heart attack. <laughs> okay, now this feels real. My name is Rachel Kirkpatrick. And I'm Joel Ashton McCarthy. And we are the co-creators of Inconceivable. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching the show. Spoiler alert, it's uh, based on a true story of Rachel and I's uh, adventures that resulted in our wonderful baby Bowie here. We are super excited and looking forward to a season two. Uh, if you'd like the show to continue, if you want a season two, the best thing you guys can do to help is to just support the show. Uh, to like it on facebook.com slash uh, inconceivable TV or share the episodes with your friends. Uh, we want to get it picked up for television and the best way we can sell people on the show is to show that we have an audience. Thank you so much for watching. It has been an awesome ride and so fun with the live videos, everything. It's been beautiful. Thank you. Rachel's going to be launching a new YouTube channel. Uh, the link will be below. Uh, we're going to keep making stuff at This Is A Spoon Studios, and we have a feature film coming out next month called Shooting the Musical, which uh, I'm super proud of. And you should be. <laughs> so um, thank you guys so much, and we uh, we really hope to continue this. Uh, we love you guys, and uh, thank you so much for being there on this wild ride, and we really want to continue this show. Thank you. Bye. Peace and love. Bye, Bowie. Bye. <laughs>